Hey guys, Silence Seo here. Welcome back to another Uta My Cross Gacha video. If, if you hear my voice like this, you probably know that I'm not feeling well. In fact, the last four days I've been reliving COVID symptoms even though I have passed the... Uh, how, how would I call it? The so-called cure from COVID period. Uh, in my country, basically, if you survive seven days with COVID, technically you are recovered from it, even though you have a negative test symptom. But um, there are certain people like myself who will still experience symptoms throughout the next few days or weeks uh, after being cured from COVID. And today is one of those worst days. I'm technically back home uh, just from coming from the A&E. Um, because I've been having such horrible times with the symptoms, probably can't tell from the last video. Uh, just that was just me putting a brave front for the re video recording. But <laughs> today was really the horrible, uh, most horrible point of the symptoms, and it's really draining me. And uh, I'm going through a lot of uh, pain right now. So I'm just gonna dive into what I need to do as quickly as I can. Sadly to say. Uh, I actually tried recording this video once, but it was just a very quick start. Then I realized that the old Valentine's gacha for Makina has disappeared. So I'm just gonna show images here from my past screenshots when the gacha was still out. So the old Valentine episode plate for Makina's uh, costume came with a total score of 3854. Um, without the plus 25 luck value, the episode play comes in at 3604, so that's not too bad. I, I can't remember exactly how much Cheryl's episode play has already. Um, my mind is not able to think back <laughs> that well at this point in time. So, with that said, Makina's episode play had a very good amount of points on voice. So takes second place and of course Charm comes at last. You might want to pay attention that Freya, Ranka and Mimei are able to use Makina's episode plate. For those of you who were able to pull the gacha, good for you guys. If you manage to get it, I think that's not too bad of a thing considering that this is not the episode plate that's only focused on a single diva. Um, set the skill for it. Unit's voice is boosted by 90% up, so fantastic center skill, but sadly to say, as usual, 6 star episode plays are no longer the main thing to have in the center position if you've gotten a 7 star episode play. Alright, moving along, on the second page for the episode plate, um, it has the modern new generation active skill, so for 5 seconds, 70% boost in score. Live skill, short duration ability, so it comes exactly like Cheryl's episode plate, almost identical. Um, so both of them come with the uh, new affection ability, so if you've got Freya, Makina, Ranka or Mimei maxed out on their affection, this episode plate is definitely worth to add into your collection, especially if you don't have anything like this yet. Looking at the last page, Sadly to say, this episode plate doesn't come with any special notes, so it's exactly on par with Cheryl. Um, the points, however, might be better, might be lower, I can't recall, so go back to view that video if you want to compare it to Cheryl's. Um, I'm sure from there you can probably tell uh, which one is actually better in terms of stats. Of course, aim for the episode plate that you know, benefits you because your waifu, your husband though, is able to use that specific episode play itself. Sadly for myself, I missed out on pulling this gacha, so that's kind of a bummer. Um, I'll probably have to unlock Makina's chocolate um, Valentine's Day costume in you know, the hard way. Hopefully to pull it out through maybe the Super Dimension gacha or future gachas maybe featuring Makina. Maybe her Makina's birthday gachas and all that kind of stuff. Anyways, let's dive into today's 7 star episode plate, which is Ray Ray's 7 star episode plates. So, as you can tell, um, I didn't pull Makina's step up gacha. Apparently, the step up gacha disappeared, even though it was supposed to stay until the 4th of March. It's 
technically the third of March that I'm recording this video. Uh, if you guys see this video maybe one two days later, you probably understand why I'm a bit puzzled by it. Technically, the step up gacha for Makima should still be around, but it's not there. I don't know if it's a bug, but every time the second seven star episode pick comes out, um, the step up gacha is replaced with the more recent one. It shouldn't be like this. Dana should definitely try and get this sorted out, you know, but it seems like no one's complaining because everyone just pulls the main feature step up in Japan um, once it comes out. So that's kind of a bummer for players like me who miss out on days of play because of illnesses or something happens, personal stuff, you know, that kind of stuff. Everyone has their issues. Anyways, let's take a look at Ray Ray's episode play and see how it fares. So, coming in, um, 4,293 total score. Um, it's actually the exact same amount of points with Makina's new 7 star episode play as well. So, with that said, the Ray Ray's episode play comes in at 4,043 total score without its plus 25 luck value. And yeah, so like I predicted in Makina's video, I'm sure Reina's episode play will come with a special note attachment. Most probably the item note attachment, but you know, I might be wrong. Um, so let's see how it goes. So as usual, the Maki Ray pairing is always able to use their partner's episode plate. And for Ray Ray's, Cheryl and Basara is able to use her 7 star to support as life skill support. Not that it matters, but you know, there are some people who would use 7 star episode plates to try and get an edge on high score. You know, it is a strategy after all. Alright, so unlike Makina's episode plate, Ray Ray's focuses on the star series or voice, or you know, um, what is it called again? Uh, I can't remember what the actual stat is called. <laughs> okay, anyways, um, 2,695 on voice, and of course, So and Chum takes the worst hit, um, just like Makina's brand new 7 star episode play as well. Center skill, as usual, if you use it on the Macross Delta series song, because Reina is from Macross Delta, you will get a 150% boost in units stats. So, moving along. Combo bonus, so it's almost identical to Makina's, even in stats, except for that the points are focused on a different uh, you know, series of points. Life skill, short score up, yet almost identical to Makina's. However, on the last page, as you can tell here, it does come with a special note, but it's different from Makina. Ray Ray comes with a score note, so which is actually better? Well, personally, Ray Ray takes the cake. <laughs> so if you are choosing between both Reina and Makina's 7 star episode play, if you are looking for scoring purposes, Reina's episode play is definitely the one you want. Makina's is definitely more just towards gaining resources for powering up episode plays or for the ticketing event we are going through. So technically both episode plays are useful for this current event. You need both of them to get that bonus percentage boost in score or points basically. Um, you can use Reina's episode play as a center position you know, episode play because it does come with a score note attachment plus it has the combo bonus ability um, that is, if you are able to retain your combos, you know, this current event song is technically kind of um, difficult to full combo as well, personally for myself. Um, I'm not a fantastic music player, but I'm considered pretty um, higher than average. Um, so, if I say it's difficult, trust me, it's, it's not as simple as it is. <laughs> Anyways, um, Moving along, okay, let's do all the pulls. Sadly to say, I would like to do Makina's Valentine's costume pool, but you know, it's not there anymore. I've used up the free daily pool, so I guess we're not gonna see any miraculous luck from single pools. 
I do have some tickets here that are gonna expire, so I'm gonna do a template pool from the Super Dimension Gacha first. Yes, I'm skipping the procedure of doing the free daily pool from the featured banner. But, you know, it's time to break traditions when I'm not feeling well. <laughs> okay, oh wow, 3 Valkyries, 5 Valkyries. So maybe this time round we'll have luck with the template pools, unlike the last video. A rainbow box, nice. Okay. Maybe they'll surprise me with Makina's Valentine costume. <laughs> that would be nice. Alright, here we go, rainbow box. No evolution. Oh wow. It's not Makina's Valentine costume, but it is still belonging to Makina. So that's pretty sweet. Uh, and yes, that's the name. Oh, it evolved too. Cool. Okay. That's pretty nice. Okay, so I'm really hopeful if we can actually pull out Rare Race episode plate today. I am prepared to do um, the step of gacha, as you can tell from my seeing stones here. Whoops. <laughs> okay, so let's let's dive into the free single pool first. I do have my subscription tickets. I do have my seeing stones as well. Okay, so no luck on the single pool. Unlike the last video where all the luck went into the single pools. Okay, so let's do the step up gacha. So the first one is the regular rate at 100 singing stones cheaper than regular. Alright, no loading at all, so that's kind of a bummer. Oh, wow, we are still getting Valkyrie animations. That's interesting. So today's luck is pretty mediocre. Oh, there's a lot of red boxes. Okay. Maybe. Might get blessed with something nice. Alright, so no evolutions on two boxes. That's not too bad. At least we're getting a lot of red boxes. Better than having none at all. Oh wow, duplicates. Okay. Someone is really upset. Alright, so four red boxes. None of them evolve. So that's kind of a bummer. But at least the luck is leaning towards the good, I guess. Considering that that was a regular rate pool. Alright, so step two, we do have our guaranteed four star and above. Although it does cost at the same amount. Oh, we do get a load bar. No. Oh, no Valkyries at all. It's kind of a bummer. So we probably just might just see a single red box. Oh, two red boxes. Okay. First one, no evolution. Okay, we got a rare episode plate. Don't see this very often. So that's not too bad. No evolution on this one too. It's an old Ray Ray plate. But, you know. At least it's leaning towards <laughs> the main theme of the video, I guess. <coughs> Excuse me. Alright, step 3. So this one is the guaranteed 5 star. So we'll definitely get a rainbow box. Well, the only problem is whether you will evolve. Oh, load bars. Very quick one. One, two, three, four, five. No golden up. Okay, you see the rainbow box. Yep, there we go. Red box so soon. No evolution on it. Okay. 
another pretty rare pistol player, I guess. I don't see it very often in my own personal pools. Yeah, Freya is invading a lot into this gacha pool. Okay, we got at least a good Reyna episode played, so that's not too bad. If you guys recall, I've been pulling this out frequently and it's one of those kinds of plates that has a special no attachment to it and I've actually Kira fight this episode plate and wow it's my first six star episode plate it has gone to a plus 10 plus 10 luck value so that's pretty nice considering that it is also an episode plate I do frequently use um, because it has a special no attachment to it all right so Last gacha pool isn't exactly a must, um, considering that the last one it does give you a two percent chance of a six star appearance, but still, two percent is kind of rare. We've seen it happen um, before, countless times where we don't get anything out from the last pool. I mean, two percent. You gotta, you gotta be realistic. It's not. A very good chance either. <laughs> okay, two red boxes. So yeah, I was expecting today's video to end up like this, but if we do get Reyna's video, uh, episode play, it's, it's really a double miracle. Um, you know, we haven't had both featured 7 star episode plates appear within the month itself for quite some time now ever since Cheryl and Ronka's um, featured 7 star with the special note attachments on it so it's been a while seriously okay so step up gacha totally not exactly fantastic okay no I was I'm wrong there is that fantastic 6 star episode plate so it's not exactly too horrible but still leaning towards the horrible side. Alright, so let's pull another template from here with the subscription tickets. Uh, for those of you who have subscribed to the special pass, you definitely have the subscription tickets as well. Um, the monthly subscription for uh, 1,500 yen. You know, it's kind of worthwhile considering that we do get other items as well, uh, aside from these 10 tickets. Okay, two red boxes. There we go, first one, no evolution. We're seeing a lot of this Hayate episode plate. Okay. Hopefully the last red box does something. Ooh. Okay, I get to see my waifu again, so that's fine. <laughs> Although she looks sad. Maybe maybe she's watching my video and feeling sad for me <laughs> because I'm not feeling well. Okay, I'm just trying to cheer myself up. Okay, um, I'm sorry, I'm losing a bit of my focus right here. Um, so let's do the discounted template pool. I do have quite a bit of singing stones left over so we might do more than that uh, trying to get Ray Ray's episode played just gotta have enough singing stones saved up for the rest of the month you know because the rest of the ice skating costumes are all coming out this month which is pretty rare to occur a full set for Valkyrie costumes in a single month All the swimming suit costumes designed by the Seiyus popping up. And yeah, mm, discounted pool, dry, that's okay. That's kind of expected. Okay, so this is where it starts to get expensive. Um, regular rates, 500 singing stones, very expensive. I'll probably, yeah, I'll probably do two. two template pools and then I'll probably have to stop because the wallet does not <laughs> allow me to continue
Okay. Sticking with the three Valkyrie animations. Oh. Okay, so we are still sticking with two red boxes. Hmm. Maybe Makina drain all the luck. <laughs> yes, I'm calling for help. Someone send help, please. In both the recovery department and my wallet. <laughs> oh god. Huh. You don't see this too frequently as well. Okay. Alright, here we go. The very last pool for this video. We'll have been using it for Makina's Valentine costume, but you know, I missed out on the gacha. I thought today was the last day, apparently in a certain timing it disappeared. Oh wow, five Valkyries. Can we end it with Ray Ray's episode plate please? That'd be nice. Yeah. So soon, single red box. Yeah, Freya is really invading on all this gacha tools. She's like everywhere in Hayate. <laughs> Doesn't feel like a Reyma pool. Seriously. Okay, there we go. One Ray Ray plate among the whole blue and red. <laughs> Evolution, but how far will it evolve? Yeah, as expected. I didn't get it. Okay. At least I got my number one waifu's episode plate, so that's not too bad on my part. And it's a new plate! You know, so okay, stay positive. At least I got something new for my Ranka collection. Hmm, score and damage. Okay, not too bad. Anyway, guys, that's it for today. I'm gonna have to end it short here. I mean, it's still a pretty long video, but you know, it could have been longer with Makina's gacha. Anyways, I'm gonna go ahead to bed. I'm gonna rest earlier. Uh, until then guys, I'll see you guys soon. You know, I, I still wish you all guys the best for all your own gacha pools and all that. It's just that. Uh, uh, I said it anyway. I, I really didn't want to say anymore. Bye.